everybody, welcome back to another video. Today, guys, we are going to be telling you guys how to get the Terra Prism. And this is actually one of the hardest items in Terraria to obtain, guys. And the way you're going to do it is by killing the actual Empress of Light, the newest boss in the 1.4 Journey's End update. You're going to kill her in the hollow while it's daytime. Normally, you spawn her or find her little glowing prismatic uh, lace wings in the hollow. And that allows you, when you kill them, these little butterflies, that it spawns the actual boss. So, guys... What you do is you're going to catch the actual lace wing with a bug net and it's going to give you these prismatic lace wings in your inventory and then you can summon them whenever you want just like a summoner just like the mechanical skull the suspicious looking eye right so you can go ahead and you know summon the freaking thing during day and then she'll be one she'll be able to one tap you she'll be enraged during the day but you do get the terror prismum if you do it it's a, a serious serious challenge but guys once you do you'll get the uh, the terror prism right here i have a ruthless terror prism and guys it is so dope we're gonna get some gameplay today with it we're gonna kill the actual um you know empress of light herself uh and see if we can go ahead and get this freaking terror prism and show you guys that that's how you do it it's a hundred percent guaranteed drop that's how you get it from um what's her name from empress of light you're gonna get it from her 100 percent guaranteed drop guys if you go ahead and kill her during the day and uh yeah guys let's go summon her right now it's actually daytime right now so she will one tap me but what I'm going to do is I'm going to use my Zenith. We're, we're super geared up with some solar flare armor, a bunch of good attachments. I do have the infinite flight, and I think... No, that's a pixie. I thought that might have been the uh, butterfly. But you can see right there the terror prism goes in. Um, we can actually fight a different boss if you guys want. Um, it's not di nighttime yet, but we can go ahead and summon... Um, once, once it's night time, guys, we'll summon a, uh, a boss... I think, I'm thinking the Destroyer. We'll fight the Destroyer and let the Terra Prism do the work. And uh, you guys will see how OP this thing actually is. It's not crazy OP, the Terra Prism, but it's pretty cool. It's a little sword that floats around your back. And it stabs the heck out of everybody. So hopefully you guys are ready for that. Um, let's go to the Hollow. The Hollow, where's my Hollow? Wait, I'm in the Hollow, aren't I? Yeah, I was in the Hollow. I'm tripping. Okay, so guys, we're in the Hollow. We can summon her right now. And yeah, let's get to it. You guys ready? Let's fight her. She's going to be enraged, so she will one-tap me. And uh, yeah, here we go. Yep. Yeah. No, she's she's pretty difficult, guys. She's pretty hard during the day. Not gonna lie. So I'm over there again and give it a couple more tries. It's almost nighttime, so when it does hit nighttime, she'll be easy. We can kill her. She won't one tap us. But uh, you have to do it in the daytime to get it to get the um the whole terror prism. And what I recommend to you guys is you guys go ahead and actually just. <coughs> What I recommend you guys is just getting a bunch of friends, and uh, if you have any, like, you know, nerd Terraria friends, you know, that just grind the hell out of the game, they'll go ahead and give you some loot so you can go ahead and kill it really easy. And honestly, just grind the game, or the, the, the boss with them, and it should be just fine. It really shouldn't be that hard. I almost died right there. Alright, we almost have her dead. She should be dead any second. We need her dead now. Oh my god. Oh, I defeated her! Right at the last second, I got her, guys. Okay, so we did this on Classic. This wasn't on Master Mode. It is way, way easier to do it on Classic. I've gotten a lot of backlash in my last couple videos of this whole Terraria experience. I don't really usually do Terraria videos, but they did some good views. So we're here now, and we're doing some Terraria videos. But this is the Terra Prism, guys. She, I ended up killing her as I died, so we did get the drop. And she was one-tapping me. There it is, guys. What is it? We got a Kaleidoscope. Oh, oh, I don't want to pick it up. And then there's the Terra Prism, the Celestial Terra Prism. Okay? I'm not lying to you guys. 100% guaranteed drop. We actually were able to kill her. That's awesome. Okay, let's let me get rid of stuff real quick. So guys, we actually were able to kill her, and there we go. The celestial terra prism. Okay, so 102 salmon damage. What's mine doing? 110. Wait, 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 wait. What? 102. So this, mine's definitely better. Okay. But this has extra speed, less mana cost. Okay, so we can get rid of this. But yeah, guys, um, if you guys also want to play with me and get some free loot and you guys aren't able to do it, just join up maybe on some of my live streams, guys, and I can give you some of this loot. It, it's not hard for me to kill her. So if you guys need help getting some dope gear, I can help you guys for sure. Um, if I'm live streaming, you guys see me live on Terraria. I'm on Twitch sometimes and I'm here on YouTube, just kind of, you know, figuring both sides out, seeing what I like more. But oh, there's actually a prismatic wing here. See, it spawned by itself. I didn't even do that. Let's fight it now. Uh, but guys, it's nighttime now, so I'm actually going to let the Terra Prism do damage, and you guys are going to see the Terra Prism in action. All right, guys, let's do this. So the Terra Prism is going to do work, guys. Come on, come on, Terra Prism, you got this. You got this. Oh my God, I believe in you. She only has seventy thousand health. 
Ow, 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 ow. She only has 70,000. Guys, will the Terra Prism be able to take down the old Empress of Light? Ow, 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 ow. Ow, 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 ow. What is hitting me? I don't even know what's hitting me. The Terra Prism is doing its best. The Terra Prism is doing its absolute best. I don't think it's going to be able to take it down. I might have to give it some help. Here, let's use the Stellar Tune a little bit. Oh my gosh! Drama! I use the Eventide on her. Yeah, I don't know if the Terra Prism is going to be able to do it without some of my help. But you can see that it does about 110 damage. It's doing its thing. It's trying. She's a lot... She's nowhere near as hard if it's not in the day. Oh my god, it is an actual grind when she's that in the day, though. Yeah! But well, highly recommend getting yourself a Zenith. And if you guys want some gameplay strictly on the Zenith and how to get it and all that, I can release that too. And then all the other stuff, like the Stellar Tune, if you guys want to see a video on that. The guitar. Woo! Alright guys, I'm going to help the Terra Prism out. It's struggling a bit, so let's go ahead and help her out. Let's give her some, give her some of that Zenith action. Oh my god, no! Okay, let's see if we can take her the rest down. Oh, she's throwing hella stuff at me! So this is a pretty cool fight. I love the fight. It feels definitely more like a Calamity or a modded fight. Definitely way cooler than a lot of the fights, to be honest. Oh! Come on, you got this! You freaking got this! Oh my god, I didn't even mean to hit her, but, you know, she's down. We took her down. There we go. We got it done. Whew! Okay, so let's get rid of some stuff. We don't need any of that. So we ended up getting a Starlight, and this is a pretty cool weapon as well. If you guys want to see some gameplay on this, I can release that as well. Let me know down in the comments. And, uh, yeah, it's pretty OP, actually. It's like an incredibly, incredibly... Ooh, we got the, st the die from her. Nice, I need more of that die anyway, the prism prismatic die. It has a lower chance to drop than most of the weapons, but yeah, guys, that's been the Terra Prism so far. It wasn't actually able to take her out, but uh, I guess let's just keep... S Wait, did I get another Terra Prism? How do I have two? I think I had that one before. Let's go, let's kill some of the bosses. So we got, uh, let's try the Destroyer. Let's see how, he, let's see how she, he, uh, he, is it he or she? Why am I, what? Why am I assuming the Terra Prism's gender? Uh, it. I don't know. Oh, it kind of like sliced down the destroyer's body and it was hitting all of its probes. That's kind of cool. I'm going to do my best not to hit it. Oh, it looks like it's actually not doing terrible damage. Look at it. It's going in. It Come on. You. Oh, it's actually doing good damage. It's not bad at all. Oh, no. I hit it on accident. Oh, my God. I hit it on accident. I did a lot of the damage for it. I don't know what to do. How am I not? Oh, my goodness. All right. Let's just get a... Let's get a... Get an Evan tied out so we can kill the probes or something. There we go. Yes. So the Terra Prism actually isn't doing totally bad to the destroyer. Look at that. I like when it like jabs down the way of the body of the destroyer. It actually does good damage. Not gonna lie, guys. But yeah, totally recommend just grabbing some friends and taking out bosses and then trying to get uh try and get the uh, Empress of Light to go down and during the day because dude, it's 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 pretty hard without you know some good loot to first off you know try and beat her. But if you're running solo, you're gonna have a real challenge, a fun time trying to beat all the bosses um, without this stuff and the Empress and stuff. So if you want the Terra Prism, get ready. It's a challenge. It's fun, but it's a challenge. You know, what I mean, it's a challenge, but it's what you know. And look, it's actually doing these damage. It's doing its thing. Yes! You got this! You freaking got this! Terra Prism! Yes! I just don't want to do hella damage to it. If I swing with my Zenith, it does like a couple thousand damage each swing. Woo! You got it, Terra Prism! Your first destroyer kill! Claiming! Claiming it! Honored! I'm honored to be here for you! I'm honored to be here with you! Yes! Take him down! Yes, the Terra Prism got it. No biggie. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. The Terra Prism got this one. I don't know about the Empress. That's a bit extreme. Look at that. Look at that. Yes. And it is done. And there we go! The Terra Prism was able to handle the good old Destroyer. Yeah, that was the Destroyer. Terra Prism took him out. Hope you guys are enjoying the gameplay so far, the content. I hope you, just, you, know, you clicked on this video, you're obviously looking at to get the uh, 
the good old Terra Prism and uh, maybe some content on it because you like the item. I really like the item. It kind of reminds me of like a samurai um, like sword. You know how it's kind of on your back, but it's like floating. So it's like a magical samurai. You know what I'm saying? That's kind of funny, but I like it. It's cool. Uh, it's dope. That's really all. That's really all. That's really all it is. I mean, what else is there to like, you know, there's not much else to say. Let's go ahead and spawn, you know, some good bosses in and uh, have some fun. So I got the three mechanical bosses here. The Terra Prism won't be able to do much, so we'll go ahead and use our Zenith and uh, go ahead and get these bosses out of here. There we go. Get them out of here. Zenith 2 OP. But yeah, guys, that's gonna really going to be it for this video. There's not much else to it. Just fight the Empress in the day and... Um, that, that's it. Yeah, that's, that, that's how you do it. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the content. Do make sure to draw a like and a sub if you guys want to see other videos of uh, gameplay on certain items. I can do a Stellar Tune video or anything like that. If you guys want to see that stuff, you know, the Stellar Tune is only a 2% drop from the Empress. It's actually decently hard to get, but if you kill her enough time, she's eventually going to drop it. But it's cool. It's, it's, it's just a guitar solo for you. And I could get mana potions and literally destroy some bosses with it. If that is what you guys want to see or whatever you guys want to see. Let me know down, let me know down below. Anyways, alright. Draw a like, draw a sub, I'm going to be out of you guys. See you in the next one. Peace out. We see the hype outside. Right from the house. Uh, took it straight from outside. Straight to the couch. We put the mic outside. Edit shit out. We letting the scouts outside. We running this couch. Ain't no control in the game, they never leave I got tests over my veins